So this is something that I've done a video on before, um, but earlier in the season when it hadn't flowered yet and it didn't have seeds to show. So I thought it'd be nice to stop and, and show you what it looks like when it's a bit further on in its growth um, so that you'll have a better chance of identifying it wherever you find it and whatever time of year. Um, it's often mistaken for parsley or celery. Um, these are quite mature leaves, so up near the top and as the plant matures they get lacier and thinner so it doesn't look much like parsley there but if we go down to the bottom these are what the leaves look like earlier on in its growth and you can see that it, it can look quite parsley like or quite celery like we've had cases on the groups that i admin where uh, apps plant apps that people use have identified this as parsley or celery um, it definitely isn't if you think you found wild parsley or wild celery the chances are you haven't there you don't get wild parsley in the UK and you don't get wild celery very many places. Um, whereas this, which is hemlock water dropwort, grows almost everywhere, is really, really common. And if you found something you think is parsley or celery, it's probably this. Um, it doesn't like focusing on it right now. Um, this is the seed. So where the flower's gone to seed, you can see they're kind of green and long. Got a little white bit on the end where the flower was. Um, and the flowers, the umbels, so these are, are known as umbels, these kind of sprays, circular sprays of flowers, is a, a collection of lots of little umbels. They're quite pretty, actually. I think it's a really lovely flower. The stems on hemlock water dropwort are completely smooth. There's no hairs on these. And green. Uh, they have ridges all the way down as you can see and where the leaf stems join onto the main stems they've got this kind of groove like a pocket like celery has when you split it apart so if you remember all of those things then you will find it quite easy to identify um, if you don't remember all of those things all you need to remember is it's definitely not wild parsley it's definitely not wild celery um, this plant has a 70 percent mortality rate i think so really worth knowing and recognizing I'm going to leave you with an image of the, the young leaves at the point where people tend to mistake them for something else. 